เจ้าโอ What's up, X? Apparently, my uh, the button I use to mute the microphone is the the speedy thing in the game. We are no longer speedy. Very sniffly. I think I might be dying. That's what that means, right? I don't know what Desune means. I'm going to assume it means I'm the greatest person in the world and roll with it. How oh, that works, by the way. Anyway. I'm going to try to finish the story today. I haven't actually, you might tell because of things, but I haven't actually done much of anything since last time I streamed. I was going to stream yesterday, but I was dying. Uh, we changed gambits. I think pretty much just Vaughn and Ash actually have different gambits. Ash has a complicated set of gambits because we have to turn hers on and off as we do stuff, unfortunately. Kind of negates the point of gambits, but hey. But she has haste, decoy, reverse, protect, reflectica, miscellaneous other things. Uh, I bought potions. I basically just bought, I sold all of my stuff and then just bought things. But not by quantity. The 99 X potions, 99 ethers, we have whatever elixirs I haven't used. 99 of basically everything except serum, because we don't need it. And we'll see how it goes. Everyone's equipped with something that makes some basic level of sense based on what I have, so. Oh yeah, we needed Ash to have more HP. We can't get her more HP, right? Yeah. Because it's locked behind things that I don't have. This tradition. Hey Zev. That is the left wall of your home. It might actually, I don't know. We'll have to see how the this works out, but Ash can't survive getting hit by things, so. Even with a bubble bell, I don't think she can survive. Hello, Pandocity. Laundry. We're gonna fly to the Sky Fortress Bahama, and we're going to skip the gutscene because I've already played it. I think where there's like three different cutscenes we have to skip, but 
We've already seen them. It's war of the flying flyers and stuff and things. Death. Everyone likes some good death question mark? Is it gonna show anything? Hey, there it goes. Did you miss the final boss? Nope. We have to get to the final boss. Which is where we're going. I was correct. It is three cutscenes. Almost like I've been here before. I always liked that effect, but it didn't make any sense to me. Why is it doing that? Seems like a safety hazard, really. Alright. So our goal is to get to the center. And there's an elevator in the center. We're also gonna do this. Right, so we're just gonna ignore every enemy in here because they don't actually want to die, so hey, hey Wes. Is it most things Sid makes a safety hazard? True, I suppose. Hey. You are a dick. Oh, I forgot there's a cutscene here. God dang it. I think Sid himself is a safety hazard. Very shaky screen, apparently. I like how he gets out of his chair to look. Resistance fights their battle well. We dare not fail them. We dare not falter. Stop worrying. We just have to clean up here, and then Ash will be the queen. Time for everyone it's to die. It's hard to believe. I can't even imagine trying to rule a whole kingdom. A queen might always run away with the help of a sky pirate looking to raise his bounty a peg. Hmm. I doubt our queen would need the help of any sky pirates. Do you really think me as strong as all that? Who said anything about strong? Well, you'll make it. You got good friends. Rude Vaughn. Anyway, let's not stand around in the middle of their, you know, essential, essentially the middle of their base. Anyway. Run away. That's not the right way. Ah, oh, hell. Ah, oh, hell. Alright, so we're just gonna cheat. Act like that didn't happen. So that's why you don't mess around in the central area. Talking is a free action. Look, don't bring your rules into this. Slow the game down so I don't run the wrong way this time, shall we? Let's have a black screen so I don't know what I'm doing. Shall we? Alright. Hey, bud. Goodbye. This is where we're supposed to go. Would have been fine if I didn't screw it up the first time, but hey. No Omega kill. I didn't even see that earlier, actually. Probably do Omega. Uh, heal yourself. So, unfortunately, we can give them uh, more fire because we're going to be using that anyway. Unfortunately, this version of Gibralt is not vulnerable to oil. His last version was, I'm pretty sure. So is he in trial mode. It's really weird. 
But he's not in this, so... We have to do this the old slugfest way. Also, you get a bonus cutscene if uh, Bosch is in your party. I'm gonna try to trigger that if we can, because bonus cutscene. So you have lived. I am Judge Magister. Even in disgrace, my just reward for aiding the Empire that destroyed my homeland. Gabranth, do not blame yourself anymore. You confound me, brother. You failed Landis. You failed Damasca. All you were to protect. Yet you still hold on to your honor. How? I had someone more important to defend. And defender I have. How is it that you have survived? Is it not because you defend Lord Laza? Silence! All was stripped from me. Only hatred for the brother who fled our homeland remains mine. How does his sword stick together? Is it just really good magnets? I do as I must, brother. Or is that not answer enough? Anyway, step one. Throw a remedy at him. So, those are the statuses he's vulnerable to, if you're curious. And now we're just gonna shoot him a bunch. Until he falls over, basically. The bonus cutscene triggers at 50%, and Bosch has to be in your party. Oh. Your friends die. Or we, I've already fucked it up, so. You cannot protect them. Know now the despair you have taught me. The bonus scene you get is just that split camera view thing where it shows Bosch's face because that's what everyone likes looking at. But anyway, he knows innocence now. He's also removed his debuffs, which is rather weird. Why'd you do that, dude? How am I supposed to kill you if you're not slow? That's the only reason this fight even takes very long, is because he renews. And then he uses innocence and probably kills somebody. What did we just remove off of him? Slow? Well, that's irritating. You missed! His strongest attack. The only thing he does that does any damage and he missed. When he does enrage he starts chaining, by the way. But he's also blind. And when I say chaining, I mean he hits you ten times. Repeatedly. Rather rude of him. Anyway, breathing intensifies round two. you the same. Let this end. Noah. He has a name. Gasp. I have no right to be called by that name. Then live and reclaim it. This is your opportunity to heal, I would recommend doing it. Because you're about to do two bosses back to back. Also, you can talk to him, I don't think he says anything though. And you, I think you thought, eh, apparently not, I thought you could. Well, it was basically Star Wars, it is, and it does a very good job of it. I like the song that plays here, by the way. It's basically over now, but, you know.
It plays like twice in the game. A very rarely used song. Kind of like 12 more than Star Wars. That's gonna upset people probably, but hey! I'm not really a huge fan of the Star Wars movies, but I do like the Star Wars games. I forgot to change. Whatever, we can do it when we get in the fight. Oh, we may as well. Well, mm, yeah, we may as well do it now. The sound for the elevator moving keeps playing when you're in menus, by the way. to my sky fortress, the Bahamut. Thank you. I must apologize for my delay in welcoming you aboard my ship. Oh, that's not a problem, don't worry. Permit me to ask... Do I like robin eggs? I don't know. Who are you? An angel of vengeance? Or perchance a saint of salvation? I am simply myself. No more and no less. Good answer. And I want only to be free. Such a woman is not fit to bear the burden of rule. Weep for Dalmasca, for she is lost. Observe well, Larsa. Watch and mark you. The suffering of one who must rule, yet lacks the power. No. No. No, brother. I will not. Though I lack your power, I will still persist. <laughs> Bold words, child. Oh, hey, Darth Vader's back. Lord Lassa. So the thing about allies in combat, such as Larsa right now, is that they are not guests. His level is not tied to my level. His level is a set level, regardless. So he's actually... I think he's level 50. And has the stats of a level 50 character, which is quite handy. But anyway. You don't have any buffs, do you? No. Vayne here, our good friend Vayne, is not, a, or, uh, not vulnerable to oil. I thought he was. Is it second form that is? Oh. Doesn't matter, we're just gonna shoot him a bunch anyway. This this fight's easy, he doesn't do any real damage. You can also tell by the fact he's losing copious amounts of health. Your lives are forfeit, and your insurgents with them. Dalmaska will again know order. Yeah, yeah. Good and all I shall bring your futile attempts at rebellion to an end. Yeah, Larsa could kill my entire party. Well, he buffed himself. That's rather rude. Just like before, he hits 50%, he gains access to abilities that he would not use otherwise. Stuff like that. Oh, don't well. Sorry, Larsa. <laughs> uh, my bad. But we're just gonna... Oh no, we, we saved it. We were about to debuff the hell out of Larsa. He's supposed to be vulnerable to... oil, but I might be thinking of a different fight. 
Either way, it's not hard anyway. This is the easy part. Could you not? He too punches the reality away. I don't know what it is with people and destroying reality, but hey. My god, Larsa. You appear to be dying. And now we do the difficult part of the fight. You can't copy my quickenings, that's cheating. Oh, Lars is dead forever. Glad we get to listen to this in HD. He's a bulky boy now. Manufactured netherite. This part of the fight sucks for multiple reasons. One of them being those swords. Which the plural of those swords is Sephiroth. By the way. Friend Lord Larsa. The hound strays. Treason bears a price. One I gladly pay. So just like before, Gabroth is not part of a party, so his level is independent, etc. 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 Anyway, time to get pissed off at uh swords and stuff. Mostly because they go around everywhere and bother me and waste time. They do have elemental weaknesses, so we're probably just gonna let Vaughn cast. I don't target Gabroth. There he is. Ah, it's him that's weak to oil. We could just burn him down. He's not blind? No, just slow in oil. Which... I don't know why dispel motes work on slow for the enemy, but hey, here we go. Ron, I'd like you to hit the boss. You'd be so kind. You know what, if you're gonna shoot random things, just do that. I would prefer they just hit him, to be honest. But you know. Peace will know a new dynast king, and man will keep his own history. The tyranny of the gods is ended. We are their puppets no more. The freedom for which we have longed is at hand. You talk a lot, my friend. Does he lose his hey he does? Alright, Vaughn. Since you still have the thing equipped, I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna turn off the spell, because they keep removing slow from the enemy, which is stupid and it annoys me. Did you not do that? Thanks. 
By the way, swords have 12,000 health. By the way, I hope we don't die. Hey, we didn't die. Fawn, can you come here? I don't know what Gabroth is doing. He's just standing there currently. You right, dude? Oh, he's targeting. He is immune to magic. Doesn't matter. But sure. Most of the swords are dead. We're just gonna do this. Just on her, though. Yeah, 22,000 damage, because he's still shooting swords occasionally. There we go. There we go. Easy peasy. He didn't even do his other, like, three attacks. This is where blood should be if Square Enix made blood in their video games. Here I pay my debt. Burn in hell! Go wrong! Oh, hey. He's not dead forever. Somehow. For some reason that's never really explained in the plot in any way, shape, or form. Why would you drop the sword? Why would you pant so heavily all the time in every cutscene? He just got electrocuted and knocked out. But, like, he absorbed his brother to become more power. It's supposed to be absorbing something from the crystal that he, Lars is holding, but the only time the crystal ever does anything is when it absorbs other things, so that doesn't make any sense, but that's what it's supposed to be. But I always just roll with he's absorbing his brother's soul. Something, I don't know, it's Final Fantasy, do what you want. We should... be out of combat? Unless I'm mistaken. I might be mistaken. Hey, bud. I have failed us both. I am no dynast king. You must find another. One who might realize your ambitions. <sighs> They are fulfilled beyond your knowing. The crest is sundered. Oh yeah, this song is nine minutes long. I forgot about that. Complete. From the undying ones, the world is freed. You shall not tread this path alone. Together we go. Come. Why is he walking out here to begin with? Like, there is actually nothing out here. I do wish FF games had blood in them, though. Like, he should be profusely bleeding from that sword wound. He 
history begins anew. To die in a pretty spot. Hey, Ramu. I think he's bad. Also, good god, that's loud. I think his first idea is to do this. This is the Undying. He has 200 and something thousand. HP. Ah, we go straight into combat. Um, so the thing with this fight is he has no health bar, he knows piercing magic, and he knows piercing to spell. He only uses piercing to spell if you buff within range of him. He won't use it to remove buffs, he'll only use it when you cast a buff. Which is really weird AI, but that's how it works. So if you're going to do any buffing here, you should do it outside of his range. But also, we should do a couple things here. Where does it put the spell modes when you... Okay. We have 56s. First thing you do is dispel him. Second thing you do, throw a remedy at him, which only causes slow, but hey, it's better than nothing. Let's say immune. Well, apparently it causes nothing now. So that was changed. That's unfortunate. It used to cause slow, but whatever. So the way you're supposed to do this fight is reverse. I'm going to try to do it without reverse. Or decoy for that matter. Which could go really wrong. Who knows? We need someone else healing. Let's try and get Ash in here. Why did she cast haste before healing? She's not set to heal, that's why she does that. Herpader. When he does chain magic, he gets CT0. Uh, let's make sure she's not doing... Oh, she is now. Basically, I'm just going to try to keep... I could do a reverse mode on someone, but... I'm going to try to keep... Ash away from him, so she doesn't get targeted by things. Why are you immune to moats? Question mark. Why are you... Well, Ash is dead in a second here, but why is... Why is that a thing? Well, that's unfortunate. Reverse moat yourself. Can you get it off in time? No. All right. Good. Goodbye, Ash. It's good knowing you. Uh. 
It should get revs here in a second. Don't do it in rage already. He's already flashing. What is this shit? Uh, we may be pushing him too fast, actually. We might be pushing him too fast. Yeah. So... The problem we've just created... Is that he is still immune to magic. I don't think we can actually do anything. Oh, he's, he's also about to just kill people, so, you know. As you do. So both of you just got removed from the scene. You know what we could do? Just do... We're gonna have to go big on X-Potions here, so Vaughn's gonna have to help out. What is he set to? 70? 40? I don't know. Fix that. Alright, Vaughn, you have to help out, so let's get this going. Why did I target you? What did you just phoenix down? Oh, now he's doing perfect defense. That's a little unnecessary, but sure. Basically, we just have to tank him now, because we can't do any damage. Unfortunately. And unfortunately, he did this... Rather poorly timed, so he's just gonna spam Giga Flare Sword for all eternity. And potentially kill people repeatedly. Yes. He's going to repeatedly kill people. How many bubble belts do we have? We have two, but you can't equip it. What about you? You can. Ow. Might be a problem. Might be a problem. Also, his attack range is infinite, but his uh, magic range is limited. Alright, well, everyone's dead, so GG, there goes that. Because he's decided to make himself immune. Hooray! Can we actually do anything about this? Because there's no Mega Phoenixes. I don't think we can. I think we're just dead. Ow. Paraflare. Could you not, though? Well, hmm. Hmm. I don't think they're getting these off in time, so... He's already doing it. Yeah. Hmm... That'll do it. Alright, well, round two. That, that round didn't go very well. If we could time a quickening chain before he makes himself immune to literally everything, that would help tremendously, but, you know. 
Also, I thought we could heal before we came in here, so a bit of a disadvantage. You wouldn't hate this fight so much if they didn't keep zooming in on his face. What's wrong with his face? Rude. Um... Oh wait, we, we don't need Vaughn, because he doesn't, doesn't take any status ailments. Bubble Belt is not going to help you survive. Yeah, he does make some rather interesting sounds during those scenes. If you, again, I have to do this every time, because it's not going to save, so... Those only haste yourself for now. What am I doing? You're a read. And Ash, fuck off away from him because it will fucking kill you. you might die anyway. Yeah, that'll do it. Man, I sure wish you could move, Balthy. Are you casting Mega Flare? Why did you kill Fran? I really have this below those. All these adjustments I should have made before coming here. Piercing Fire. I'm over here, though. Fuck you. Thanks. So nobody heals anybody. Because if you do, you will kill Vaughn. Balthier, whatever his name is. Immune to magic. Don't know why I'm casting protect on you, but hey, there you go. And Ash is dead again, by the way. Welcome to Ash's life. It doesn't actually matter what he's doing, it is going to kill him. Or her real quick. Hopefully. Ah, uh, shoot. Has he already made himself immune? Question mark. I don't know if he's made himself immune. We're going to find out eventually when this is done. The dispel went through, so he's at least not immune to magic. This isn't magic, though, so that's kind of null and void. You know, I never understood why this didn't count as magic. He's flashing red, he should have like something like 40 or 50,000 health or something like that. So it is entirely possible to kill him with a chain. I don't know what his exact health is because you can't tell, even with a Libra, you don't know what his health is. I never sort of fucked that up, but hey. Did you guys know there's a proper way to do everything? It's not the way I do it, be curious. Alright, 
so at this point we're just rolling off of RNG because I don't think anyone has any gauge. Charge, whatever. Praise be to RNG. Is this? Come on. There was a second mischarge, so RNG Jesus didn't let me down. I just let RNG Jesus down. Oh, hey, thanks, bud. Oh, there's another one. Oh. I wish you'd let me know you were willing to do that, but hey. This one takes so long, and then he just says ah at the end of it. I must endure. Ah, good, I get to watch it again. Ah. RNG's been pretty good so far, so praise be. Ah. It says ha, but you know. Close enough. We're down to a second. Which means there's no rerolls, probably. Well, we could get one if we get really lucky. Oh. We got pretty lucky. This would be a, a fantastic time to get Black Hole, assuming he's not immune. If he's a moot, a uh, moot. If he's immune, we're basically just wasting all of our time. Because this won't do any damage anyway. But if he's not, this will be fantastic. Oh, there it goes. 16 hits. Luminescent? Nope. That's disappointing. They're missing level 2s, I think. Is he dead? No. How much health does he have, though? Check on the clothes and I come back and you finish. No, we're still fighting. We're abusing brain buffers at this point, basically. By the way, I should point out you don't actually get anything for beating the game on this mode. You get a grand total of zero things. Oh, you meant the quickening. Ah. Oh, there's a mischarge there. Dang it. He has to be really low on health now. Because he was crit before we did that, and then that... That was garbage. That hit for 33k? Which I thought was all the health he had, but apparently I'm a little more than that. Please don't be immune, basically. I get an internet hug? Oh man, I like hugs. Whoa, I was hitting the button so hard. If you hit the button harder, by the way, it does it faster. That's not true, don't break your controller. Everyone should have charge now, I think. Mostly low charge, but hey, at least I got some. What could go wrong? I should have used Vaughn, so stupid. I did it again. 
That didn't matter. Bone only has one charge, so if he shows up, we should always use it. have any time left. Mm. We have less than a second. And nobody has any charge now, I think. So we're at the mercy of RNG to give us something here. Less than half a second, I think. No, slightly. Oh, it gave us something, but it wasn't enough time. Oh. That one shouldn't be very good. Yeah, same as the other one. But it should be about 30,000 damage again. Which, if he's not immune, maybe it kills him. He's dead. Champ. The greatest video game history. Good god, dude. Just because you're dying horrifically doesn't mean you need to scream. Calm down, jeez. Woo! That is by far not the hardest fight in the game, though, so, you know. But hey, we finished the story, at least. <laughs> hey, by the way, they're still at war with each other. Continues standing around doing nothing. We probably saved the moon too, you never know. And probably a crystal somewhere. Probably well, not the Triforce though. No fuel goes to the Glossair engines. Vaughn, you're in charge. I'm checking the engine room. Right. Shaky camera means dramatic. By the way. Look, Bahamut's gloss air rings are stopping. Oh, that can't be good. Vaughn, as soon as the Strahl's rings move, you take off. Understood? You can fly her, Vaughn. Just do it like I told you. Don't worry. Penelo, watch for interference from Bahamut's Skystone. The Strahl's a fickle girl. You keep her working for us. I'll see what I can do. Look after Lasso, will you? If House Solidor should crumble, the Empire would fail, and civil war would take us all. I understand. The Lord Lasso is our last hope. Something. Sir, it's the Stroll. She's left Bahamut. She's moving away. The Stroll. They made it. At last. 
The Bahamut has fallen. The final test is upon us. The judges shall rule us no more. Main cannon on the Alexander. This is Judge Magister Gabon. All forces cease fire. I repeat, all units of the Arcadian Army, hold your fire. The battle is over. As of this moment, we have signed a ceasefire with the Shelley of Benargan del Masca, the Royal Majesty. What game slash challenge I do next? I don't know. Okay. Wes wants me to do FF10. But I'm not doing sphere level zero FF10, because that's awful. The Imperial fleet is now under my command. Sir, your orders, sir. This is Ashalia Delmasca. The Lady Ash. Thank the God you live. I confirm what Judge Magister Cabranth and Larsa Solidor have said here. Please stand down your attack. The war is over. Ivalice looks to the horizon. A new day has dawned. I was wondering why you said healthier. I was very confused. Healthier dialogue. The best kind. Anyway, Bahamut's falling, by the way. Look, Vaughn, the Bahamut. A message from the Alexander. Take it, sir. This is Judge Sarkabat, captain of the Alexander, flagship of the 12th Damascan fleet of the Arcadian Army. I address all ships in Ravanaster's airspace. The Bahamut must not be allowed to fall on the city of Ravanaster. We are preparing to ram her. Do not interfere. Madness. Should she fall, the paling will not hold, and all Ravanaster will be obliterated. All ships, concentrate your fire on the Alexander's remains once Bahamut is clear of the city. Hasty, aren't they? I think it's a little early to be throwing away our lives just yet. Both here? Wait, Balthier, where are you? I always like how they just noticed he wasn't there. Oh, Vaughn. Sounds like you made it out okay. The Straw's a fine airship, eh? What does he think he's doing? Balthier! Marquis, stop that. FF9 without items. <laughs> I don't know about that. Just getting somewhere with these gloss air rings. Almost done. Don't want him ramming me before I fix them, do. Balthier, do you understand exactly what it is you're doing? Princess, no need to worry. I'm the leading man. I've forgotten my role in this little story. I'm the leading man. You know what they say about the leading man? He never dies. Except for when he does, occasionally. If you just ignore all of the instances where the leading man dies, then they never die. Fran, please. Fran always cracking jokes. Vaughn! The Strahl's in your hands. You'd better take care of her, you hear? There's one scratch on her when I get back. Roger that. We'll be waiting for you. Woo! He's dead forever. I meant to mention that at the start of the stream, but I wish once Bahamut was on the map it changed the skybox in Rabinaster, but it doesn't. It'd be pretty cool if you could see that the Bahamut just kind of chilling in the skybox from Rabinaster, but nope. Nowhere to be seen, despite being basically directly over top of it. Anyway, we win!
And this is the part of the stream where we get copyright strikes. Woo! I'm not actually joking, by the way. Every time I've played this game, you might have noticed this part was always in a separate it's video. A year has passed so quickly. This, this Core Enix doesn't mess around with their song copyrights. Rabinaster is finally back to the way it was. Like when my parents were still alive. We've lost so much. But I think it's important to put the past behind us. And keep our eyes on the road ahead. If you must move on Ash's coronation is next month. She grows farther and farther away from us. But I it'd be cool if there was like an after story optional dungeon. Now, after all. Like in the remains of the Bahamut or something. That'd be kind of neat. I am looking forward to seeing you at the By the way, kiss me goodbye, chat. You called my lord. Kissy face. Arcades to further the cause of peace in Ivalice, <laughs> but still, I hope he comes back to Rabinaster and Ash soon. She has to keep up appearances now, so she would never say it, but I think she misses him. Lose Lhasa, and we lose the Empire. Protect him. I would entrust him to no other scare. I will keep him from harm. I promise you, for the Empire and for Damasca. You would Bumiri's brother. Sorry to leave you. I actually forgot how long the ending was. having her tuned up, too. Shame Revenant Wings is complete trash. I never played through Revenant Wings. Like I started to, I got through basically the tutorial, essentially is what I got through, and then like just like a little bit of the intro, but never played through it. So Vaughn's going to pay the two of them a visit. <laughs> it didn't seem it. very good to me. Wait. Good Sky Pirate needs a partner, right? Also, why does the airship hangar open when he's so far away from the city? I always thought that was a little bit of a weird part of the, the ending cutscene. Be the credits, I think. Yeah. Which we're not watching.
I should kind of, kind of wanted to listen to the music, but... I forgot we have to watch it without restarting the game. Well... Is there a save at the end? I don't remember. That help. Is there a save after the credits? Is it even relevant if there's a save after the credits? I don't think there is. I don't think it is, I should say. Why do I have to keep playing this on different consoles and not being able to skip the credits? Because I have a problem. Listen here. Y'all keep watching me play it, so... I don't think I'm the only one with a problem. Around these parts. What would you guys actually want to see me play? Like, there's still some things to do here.
verbiage, so. Actually, one of my tablets is garbage, the other one is really good. The garbage tablet that I usually use is the Amazon Fire 8 or something, or 6, I don't know what it is. The cheapy one, it's like 40 bucks. Someone sent it to me. The other one I have is a Dell Venue something, Venue 8 Pro, which is a really good tablet, but it's a Windows tablet. I can't play mobile games on it. But it's a really good tablet. I think it's dying though, because like, if I use it for five minutes, the back of it is like 8,000 degrees. It actually like burns if you touch it, so I don't use it. Dishonored one or two. Uh, I don't own those either. What? I'm now begin my adventure anew in New Game Plus. Wowee. That's cool. So they kept this menu in, despite the fact you can pick it at the start. Play a Sonic Adventure game? Yo, I love Sonic Adventure 2. I actually have already recorded Sonic Adventure 2. But I really like that game. So it took 37 hours to beat the main story, plus a bit. Plus the hunts, most of the hunts. You know, I, I just... the game is, like, real janky. Yeah, I know you don't know shit. The game's real janky, but, like, I love the Chow Garden. It's such a stupid thing, but I, I love it. You, the little racing minigame? Okay hand emoji. <laughs> I kind of want to do Slay the Spire for a little bit. Oh, what do I have currently available to play? I'm pretty sure I have... Uh, what? what I don't know what I meant to do. Oh, hell. Everything's ruined now. There we go. Pretty sure I have Lost Sphere, but it's being janky with a controller, and I do like using a controller. Hold on. Let me try and load it. Might be loud, by the way. Also, it's not full screen. Why are you doing this? Question mark? Yeah, it's not... I don't know why, it says input type gamepad. But like, it doesn't, it doesn't do anything. And then, hold on, I'll show you. Like, it's a, apparently a thing that I'd have to look